Hi Libra, this is Nayla Latrice. I am here to do a read for you guys. If you guys are new, welcome, welcome. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'm sure you'll love it over here. Also, um, I am available for personal reads. All of that information is available down below in the description box. And then I encourage you to join my Patreon community. We do weekly live reads every Sunday okay so go ahead and check the description box let's jump into your reading Libra let's see what signs you could be dealing with it doesn't have to be but let's see whose energy is strongest around you spirit what signs are Libras dealing with what signs are Libras dealing with huh? oh you're dealing with your own sign. Okay. We have Libra that wanted to just, that's the energy I was feeling. And let's get one more spirit. One more. What sign is Libra dealing with? Leo. Okay. So we are in Leo season. So you guys could be dealing with a Leo. And then we have Pisces at the bottom of the deck. Again, doesn't have to be, but those are the energies that are coming out the strongest for you guys right now. Let's go on and see what is going on with you guys in love. What's going on with you? Uh, definitely dealing with the Leo, but with Libra's relationships. Great spirit with messages. Okay. So we have stay optimistic about your love life. Great spirit with messages do you have for Libra and their relationships? What messages do you have for Libra and their relationships? Forgiving and learning and make the effort. So what I am picking in engagement. So this is very clear to me. So Libra, this is for those that of you that are actually in a relationship. OK, um, it doesn't mean singles. You have to click off. But for right now, we're going to get into the tarot. But for right now, this is somebody that you guys are in a relationship with. Um, it could be somebody that you may have just recently separated from as well okay so even if you're single you guys could have just separated from someone and you're still trying to see what is going to happen within that connection but what I'm picking up on the spirit is telling you to stay optimistic about your love life because you guys are able to work this out whatever it is you guys just have to learn how to forgive one another okay I feel like you guys may go at each other's throat or you guys aren't communicating well with one another I'm hearing uh heard so someone feels like they're not being heard within this connection or within this relationship and that's all they want they just want to feel like they're heard and so Libra spirit is telling you to make the effort this is on your part okay so spirit is saying that you have to put in more effort within this connection um, I'm hearing I just deliver the messages please don't come for me I'm hearing lazy. So I feel like Libra, you guys just want the other person to do everything. And Spirit is saying that's not how it works. OK, you have to put in effort as well. It's a give and take relationship. I'm hearing don't lose this person. Libra, you guys are dealing with a good person. Whoever you guys are with, this is a really good person. And this person is sad and this person is hurt. And Spirit is telling you not to lose out on this person. I'm hearing ego. Your ego could be getting in the way. Some of you guys could have just gotten engaged to this person or this person was wanting to ask you to uh, marry them, but they they're not because they see that there's still some things that needs to be worked out. But whoever this person is, they do want to um, they do want to take things to the next level with you. But again, there's just some more kinks within the uh, connection that has to be worked out first before you guys can go to this next level. OK, let's get into the tarot. Whoa. Oh. Okay, and see what is going on here. So first out we have is the three of pentacles. 
and then the Hierophant. See, this some of you guys are actually married to this person, and you guys could be in separation from them as well, okay? But this person, they definitely want a commitment with you. They want to reconnect with you. So if you are not in, if you guys are separated right now, and you're you, you're waiting to see how things are going to turn out, this person, they really do want to make things work with you. They really do want to come together. I also feel like there's some type of collaboration that will be happening for you on the work front as well. Some of you guys are artists or painters and you guys may be opening up a studio or something or some type of creative space. Okay, or you guys are looking for some type of place to create your artwork or your work uh, as an entrepreneur or as an artist. It doesn't matter what type of creative, but I'm picking up on being an artist um, or a writer. I'm hearing quiet space. You want a quiet space. To where you could just do you, okay? Um, so maybe you guys need a break as well, Libra. You guys just need a break from everything and from everybody to clear your head. That way you can get the right answers about what you should be doing uh, with this connection. But this is definitely, uh, some of you guys are actually married, okay? Or you guys are go going to be getting uh, married soon or engaged soon, excuse me. Um, also, for some of you guys, this could be a work romance uh, that you guys are in and you guys are separated from one another as well. But somebody is really missing you, Libra. Somebody is really sad over you and they miss you a whole lot. I'm hearing hold you. They just want to hold you. They just want you back in their arms. I'm also hearing, tri I heard, but you tripping. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's not funny. That's just the way that the ancestors delivered it. But you tripping, Libra? I'm, I, I just got to deliver the messages how, how, how it is. But this person is ready to move forward. And it's like, what are you doing is what I'm hearing. So I don't know. Sometimes you got to know when it's you. You got to be real and say, yeah, I am me. That is me. Yeah, I got to I gotta get it together. You know, so just be honest with yourself, Libra. Okay, there there could be. Um, don't I'm, I'm hearing somebody argue it down as if you're the one saying, well, what about them and what they're doing? It doesn't matter. So that means you're not supposed to change or you're not supposed to focus on you. Because even if you get with somebody else, you still have to focus on you and make sure you're in the right energy as well Libra for whoever okay but this person they really do want you so stop tripping so you don't miss out on this this person because they're a really good person yeah you guys are on pause right now with this hanged one here you guys are definitely on pause or you guys are not speaking. Um, if you guys are living in the same house, you guys are sleeping in the same bed but you guys have your backs turned towards one another is also what I'm picking up on Spirit, what messages do you have for Libra? What messages do you have for Libra? You have to make a decision. They're going to give you an ultimatum. They're tired, Libra. Your person is tired. Uh, they're going to give you an ultimatum. So you're going to have to have a decision that you have to make. Again, there's a lot of work energy here. You may be working a lot too. This person, you may be... Um, you may be giving your work more attention than what you are giving this person is also what I'm picking up on right now, Libra. So they're going to give you some type of ultimatum. Uh, I'm not sure if it's going to be between work or whatever. Let me tell you this now, Libra. I don't care how good a person is. You you focus. You always be you. You always Make sure that you 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 don't change who you are for anybody. You change because you recognize it's what you need to change or you're willing to change for someone because you love them and you recognize your behaviors are hurting someone. But if someone is giving you an ultimatum between you and work, don't ever stop being who you are creatively. But you do have to learn to adjust and share your energy and your time. If, when you're in a relationship, that's what it's going to take. You have to be able to balance out your family life, your career life, your personal and social life. It takes work being in a relationship. But look, somebody is rushing back towards you somebody is rushing back towards you somebody want, I'm hearing I want answers now 
somebody can't wait somebody want answers right now so i'm not sure if there's something that you guys some type of un unsaid conversation or something um but somebody is I'm feeling the energy of somebody is angry or they're just not angry like they're going to be like, you know, like, oh, you know, towards you. But it's kind of like they're 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 restless. They're kind of like, I got to know now. Like, no, you tell me right now. They're very determined. They're very determined to get these answers because they want to know what is going on with you in the relationship. And they don't like the fact that they feel like they're in limbo waiting they feel like they're in limbo waiting and it's like they want an answer. Simply put, they want an answer from you. Yeah, I feel like you're on your phone all the time, Libra. It's like you you give them you give you give like Instagram or your work or other people more attention than what you're giving this person. I'm also hearing sensitive. I feel, I feel Libra, you feel that they're just being very sensitive about the situation, but <laughs> you're kind of like, you just being too sensitive and I'm hearing compromise. Fair to saying you have to compromise. I do feel this is about work. I do feel like you're committing to work or other things more than what you are to them. And it's kind of like when you're done working, you just want to have your free time and you want your space to create and do all these other things. Do what makes you as an individual happy. But this person is feeling left out. You're leaving them out and they don't like that. And they're they're want to rush towards you because they love you. They want to they want to marry you. They want to be with with you or if they not in the energy of wanting to marry you they definitely want to take this relationship to the next level so maybe if you guys are not living together then they're ready to move in with you got with you or uh, move in together or um, if you guys are just dating, they're ready to say, hey, we're actually boyfriend, girlfriend, and we're exclusive. Whatever the case is for you, they're wanting to take this uh, relationship to the next level, but you got to stop tripping. <laughs> I'm not trying to say it like that, you know, but that's just that's just what it is. So um, I'm here to t read the energy so you can have the right advice for you for your uh, for your relationship so you can make this work. But this is a really good person here Libra and they really do make it work I think this is a really beautiful read for you guys actually okay look we have healing imagine yourself and your beloved surrounded by light Feel your relationship being healed this very moment. So picture you and your loved one meditate on this and just picture you guys holding one another and you guys are just surrounded by this white light and there's nothing but pink hearts coming down all around you. And just imagine that spirit really does have your back and spirit really is healing this connection for you. But I'm hearing you have to want it. You have to really want it, Libra, okay? That message is who it is for. That seems kind of like it was more specific, but let me know in the comments how it does resonate with you guys. Again, I am available for personal reads and my Patreon is open for anyone who wants to join uh, our weekly live readings, okay, every Sunday. So, uh, go ahead and uh, click the link, the links below for all of that information. OK, uh, that is going to be it for you guys. Go ahead and thumbs up this video and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next one.